Let me tell you a secret. There is not enough time in a day. Or that's not actually true. There's plenty of time in a day, but, you know, I waste half of it sleeping in until noon. This morning I realized that I did not do as I had intended yesterday, which was to visit my old job, the food bank. And so I thought maybe I would do that today, but it just occurred to me that I just don't have enough time. Here's a list of things that I need to do today. I need to do this vlog. I need to clean this house because I told my roommate that I would uh, because they're very busy and I'm unemployed. Uh, I need to edit my resume. As I said, I am unemployed. I was going to go visit them, but now that I think about it, I can't get to the food bank and back in time to do everything else that I need to do today. And, of course, there's a really important email in my inbox that I just have to reply to, and I meant to do that yesterday, but it's... I don't know if you've ever been here, it's not like a business email or something like that, it's a personal sort of thing, but it's kind of important. And it's important in the way that you want to get it done now, you don't want to put it off at all, but you don't feel like you can really engage with it at the level that it needs to be engaged with at this moment in time. So it needs to be done now, but you can't do it now. Ugh. What's happening on Twitter? You know, my Twitter feed changed permanently the day that I started following Mikola. Not in a bad way, just in a very different way. I kind of hoped to do a Nepal vlog today because I still have like a ton of footage and like several vlogs planned out that I just never got around to. But all of my footage is on an external hard drive. It's just such a pain because it's slow and, you know, you can't even look at it the wrong way, otherwise the drive will stop working. So I think that'll be my project when I'm back in Cornerbrook. At least in St. John's, I can say, oh, there are things that I need to do. I need to do resume, I need to go look for a job, I can, you know, blah blah blah, this, that, and everything else. But in Cornerbrook, there's not a whole lot for me to do because I'm not going to be staying there, I'm just visiting. And if mom is working, and if my brother's working, well... What am I going to do? Maybe I'll write. Maybe I'll do this sort of stuff. I'm not sure what else I should be saying. I need to shave really bad. There's that. Yeah, there's a church life group that meets at my apartment every Tuesday. Um, my roommates, the people with whom I have moved in, um, have been doing this for a little while. And so I was there last Tuesday and it got me thinking about a few things. And so I blogged about that. Uh, I can put the link in the doobly-doo. Uh, thoughts on the afterlife, basically. Uh, and for the last day, I've been doing very little but watching Tales of Mere Existence, which you should check out if you haven't watched it before. I'm going to link uh, two of my favorite ones right here. Um, and sometimes I wonder why I even bother to vlog, because I just sit down at the end of it and I think, what did I say? Did I say anything of substance? The answer is no, of course. The point right now, I guess, is less to do something amazing and just to do something because I get in and out of habits really, really easily. I'm a person who doesn't form concrete habits very well, so I think it's important just to do it even if it's crap. So I'm sorry. Um, yeah. Anyhow, I better go because I gotta clean dishes and vacuum the apartment and shave and watch more YouTube. I mean, not watch more on YouTube. What are you talking about? Alright, goodbye now.